Hi guys, George from Cyprus Insight and this evening it's about six o'clock the sun's just going down a little bit so it's cooled down and we thought we'd come and have a stroll down the promenade or our famous coastal path and we're going to start here at Fig Tree Bay and there's Zorbus that's a great place if you want a snack or you want to a sandwich it's a fantastic bakery guys if you're not all inclusive or you've not got any food included it's very economical and uh, if you want a little picnic maybe you want to go down to the sculpture park and have a little picnic you could uh, pick up a sandwich or two a cake and all sorts and I do believe they might do hot food as well so Zorbus, the bakery, that's up there and that'll be opening up shortly. Okay. So this is Fig Tree Bay, guys. There's Fig Tree Bay just over there. There, can you see? Yeah. And there's some people having an afternoon or late afternoon swim. And you can swim out to the island, guys. There we are. There's water sports there, loads of restaurants. And we're going to go towards McDonald's and uh, the other end of Brodara. So we're going to take our coastal walk back in this direction, guys. Now, if you walk down this coastal path in this direction, keep going you can get to Caparis and of course this time of the evening you've always got a dog walker hello there we are plenty of people coming out this time of the day for their evening stroll even locals and if you're here off season and come down here guys you often come across a lot of people enjoying this coastal promenade walk highly recommend it of course if you're feeling active you can always have a go at one of these gyms they have outside they were open air gyms all free you go up and down them and scoot things around not really sure guys And there's always new things appearing. The local council always put new stuff out, guys. This park is quite new. And uh, this area down here is quite new, guys. I think it went up last year. It's a decking area, and I do believe it's going to be covered soon. I'm not sure. And there's conveniently located benches for the evening to come down here in the evening. It's a great idea. There we are. You see, very modern, all stainless steel. There we are. And what beautiful views of the sea you can get from here. So you can relax. Look, people having a drink. So it's, there's no bars here guys, you know, you can pick up your own little takeaway and have it here. Now this is about two years old, this area. There we are. And they've built it over these rocks, you see. Yeah, can you see? Look at that blue sea. Let me show you the rest of Brodara. Look, let's go down there and show you. There we are. And right down there, at the end is the boat pier and that's what we're heading for. You down our lovely path and we and it a great walk Lennox. Yes. We're having a lovely evening walk. The sun's just coming down. There's a, someone enjoying these uh, gym equipment. So now the sandy beach starts again. So we've got this rocky area, Fig Tree Bay. And now we're going on to the sandy area. 
Look down we go. So guys, if your hotel doesn't offer a spa or a massage or you fancy one while you're out and about, there's always these lovely massage places. Look, there they are, and the pe people are great. We've got a male masseur and a female masseur here, guys. So that's great. And she's going to show us some few things going on. What's going on, guys? Could hello. You... Hello. <laughs> we that... have a lot of different types of massages. Oh, you have, haven't you? Now, can I have a yeah, look at your prices? We have right. four different languages so for... the prices. So 20 minutes is just 16 euros 16. oh wow guys so it's much cheaper than the hotels Definitely. um but so uh, the same amount is certified as in the hotel don't worry so you're certified masseurs aren't yes. you and uh so guys if you want uh, a male masseur or ladies if you want a muscular <laughs> masseur this is the chat to come to there we are and can we have a look at your little massage area of course please lovely Oh, let's have a look now we've got our flowers and if you want a bit of privacy guys because we're we just on yes yes we can close the curtains guys so a little bit of privacy so if you want to come here and you they close the curtains for you and we've got our flowers and everything our and the papers are clean after every massage with antiseptic don't worry about any bacteria we're oh. using 100 percent pure coconut oil wow brilliant and and you change everything after every massage don't yes, you sir. yeah we've got uh, new towels yes, and tissues right guys so it's all it's easier for us it's easier if the customer is bringing their own towels as well brilliant if so don't have no problem, it's not a problem towels. right and what's our speciality at the moment what we're going to specialize in you can have a relaxing massage, you can have a strong massage. Right, just just full tell body. you what you fancy and you do it, won't you? Uh, I like full body massage to be honest. Oh, because I want to, uh, to relax the whole body if I decide to. I think that sounds like a great idea. And how much would be a full body massage? Full body massage is uh, one hour 44 euro. Wow, that's a whole hour guys for just 44 euros. This is the place to come. So guys, if you fancy a massage, there we. Are. This is the place to come. So whereabouts are we? Let's just see whereabouts we are. There's a massage place, guys, and we're just beyond Fig Tree Bay. If you're looking for this place, okay, guys, just beyond Fig Tree Bay. So if you're not sure where this place is, it's just outside the Silver Sands Hotel. Okay, guys, if you fancy a massage. Right, let's continue down it looks like they're building a new hut for the lifeguards it looks like it's all solid hardwood wow now that is an impressive building isn't it you know it's 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 amazing it's all made of hardwood look guys Look, the joinery work is really good and there's going to be a ramp look I'm not sure what that's going to be for look anyway we'll be up here in a few weeks time maybe next month and we can see what it's going to be I thought it's for lifeguards but maybe not looks too good not that lifeguards are bad I'm just saying it's uh, not just a shed okay let's carry on down along our famous coastal path and now it becomes a boardwalk changes changes sorry so you can see that these are locals just passing me and they're having a chat chit chat and walking their dog there they are So all the sand's been sifted just at the beginning of the season so everything's clean and tidy. All the sunbeds are out now. That's two euros fifty per item if you want to rent a sunbed or an umbrella. 
And of course, if you're staying in one of these hotels, they've got all their sunbeds complimentary out for you. Yeah. Oh, there's another one of these beautiful cabins going up, two-story cabins, guys. It does look like it's for Coast Guards. There it is there. All made of hard wood. Beautiful joinery. Veranda. She could live in that. Right, most of the places have got WCs, guys. There's the WCs over there. So if you get short on the beach or on your coastal path, there's always a WC around. That's also got a ramp. Can you see? I think it's for the Coast Guards and they'll be launching something for rescue. Yeah, it's the same building, isn't it, Lennox? Yeah. As up the road. Yeah, but it looks more like a shed. It does look like a shed, but it's a very posh shed. Yeah. I wouldn't mind a shed like that in my garden. probably still about 25 degrees guys but because we're in the shade it feels like about 20 oh there we are there's another one of these massage places guys right next to the promenade okay I'm worried they didn't open past a big something. Oh. So, passing Constantino's the Great Hotel, guys. Fantastic place. Check out the video. And there's Flamingo Paradise. It's a brand new hotel, guys. Again, check out the video on Flamingo Paradise. It opened last year. And it's a really nice place and a lot of these hotels down here do have some spectacular spas now it's tuesday today we've just finished a busy weekend a bank holiday weekend so it's a little bit quieter And if you are staying in this area, guys, in the weekend, you're better off staying at your hotel or going out a little bit because this area can be very, very busy with weekenders. Okay, so that's my recommendation. Weekend, stay in your hotel. And then during the week, if you fancy coming out on the beach, that's a better way of doing things. So what we're going to do guys, we're going to head towards the boat pier and we're going to end at the boat pier. We can show you some of the trips and we'll see what the prices are like this year for the boat trips. Now the boat trips go out to the Famagusta, which is in that direction. And then they come back up here towards Capo Greco. And you go into a few caves. You have a uh, swimming stop. And they serve drinks and ice creams and what have you on board. It's always been great value for money. A must do trip. So let's go and have a look. There's only two boats there at the moment. But I do believe normally there's about four or five boats down there to choose from. So finally here we are guys at the boat pier at the end of our stroll. And there's the little kiosk guy where so you can get your tickets. And we're going to go and see what they've got to offer. Now I do believe they do a sunset cruise. Oh, we can ask this chap here. He's going to tell us all about his 
Bow, that's uh, St. Georgius. Here we are. Hi, St. Georgius Bolt. Hello, sir. Hello. What have we got going on t this evening? This evening we got nothing. Okay, can you tell us about the sunset trip? Yeah, our sunset trip, the first one of the season, is going to be on Friday. Friday. And it's, it's going to be the family sunset because in the season we're going to have an adult uh, sunset with the DJ. So for this week is this one. So this week, guys, we've got a family sunset cruise. It's 35 euros for the adults and 19 for the children. And that includes drinks, soft drinks, wine and there's a buffet yes sir. wow there's a buffet and where are you going to go where are we going to go we skip for the family study yes we stay mainly around this way near right. the cape greco cape greco yeah we we have swimming stops if you like right. green bay and blue lagoon great uh, we see the sea caves right we tell you the legends brilliant and that's have, that's on the sunset cruise. Yeah. We have a glass of champagne Ooh. at the Lovers Bridge. Oh, we're gonna have a, which, a which is included in the price as glass well. Glass of champagne at the Lovers Bridge is all included, guys. So and then we go to have we see this one the leaf. blue lagoon yeah. and the lighthouse. Yep and then and we, we see the sunset yep. and turn back we see the sunset up the lovers bridge right and in a few weeks time we'll be putting on the adult evening trip which is the dj dancing sunset cruise guys so if you're into that sort of thing it's 45 euros per adult of course it's adults because it's a disco evening cruise you get all your drinks and guys champagne white wine soft drinks waters local spirits with a mixture if they don't fancy the wine right so for just 45 euros guys you can drink right through the whole cruise it's an all-inclusive cruise and that's just 45 euros so during the day there's other cruises guys there is lot captain panikos there's the submarine and we'll go and have a look at them and then we can finish our evening stroll here we are we're gonna finish our lovely evening stroll and we do come across some nice people that want to come on our channel our hunky masseur and the lovely lady masseur um, nice man with our boat Georgios and we're gonna go to the end of the pier guys there we are great place to relax there we are the chap's having a little bit of a fish I think he might have caught something nothing there guys just his bait right so here's the boats here we are the yellow boat cruise we've got the dolphin glass bottom boat there we are and you can see the times it goes off 11 in the morning and then it goes also off at 2 in the afternoon so there's two trips and it looks like the trips are just 15 euros guys so 15 euros for adults and this particular one we've been on before it's just five euros for children now, i'm not sure if those prices were going to change because this boat's not here yet and the season's not quite ready there's george's boat look st george's that's a smart looking yacht isn't it so guys on that note don't forget to like and subscribe and if there's somewhere you'd like me to go put it in the comments below